24. Oh, oh man. Marcel, how you feel? Feeling good, man. Feeling good, man. Excited for this year, bro. Excited for the show. For sure. Speaking of exciting for the show, man, we got we got one of the best co-hosts we can get in the world. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes money can't buy what you want. You need connections. Right. <laughs> man, we got the one and only Reggie Ball in the yeah. building. Yeah. Yes, sir. Happy to be here, man. Thank y'all for pulling up, uh, uh, letting me pull up on y'all, man. Happy nah, for back. real, Reggie. With, when it come, when we talking football and just talking sports in general, I notice when we have some validation on the couch, and especially when they agree with me, they take me more serious. <laughs> cool. That's why I'm back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we ain't even going to hesitate. Michigan versus Alabama. Hey, watch it work. Both of them games, they were some great games. Facts. Very entertaining. I loved them. Now, before we even jump into that, do we feel like Georgia should have been in there? Yes. No. You know why I didn't want Georgia in there? Because what they did to Florida State. Exactly. If you're going to be a bully, be a bully to a bully school. Florida State didn't even play everybody. You want to run the score up and go live and be eating on the sideline, bro? No. They were eating on the sideline? Yeah. They, they did the same thing in the national championship last year when Crazy. it was a blowout. Eating on the sideline, chilling. Well, you got to make a statement, bro. That's why you're supposed to win. Make a but statement. But see, if you beat Alabama, it's no discrepancy. You in the game. Man, that's the best team in the country. Who? Get it to them. Georgia. Hey, you know they're saying a lot coming from me. Yeah, that's the yeah. That's a, <laughs> Come on, bro. Like, hands down. I mean, they, it is what it is. You play the game. Any given Saturday, any given Sunday, or whatnot. But you know, unfortunately, they had a, a, a let up in the SEC championship. But you clearly, that team is a uh, a little better than everybody. Now, I, I could agree to an extent, but after watching Michigan, Michigan defense will give anybody trouble, mm. especially George, the quarterback. If Alabama was giving giving him trouble like that, imagine what Michigan defense would do. Yeah, I think. Carson's a better, he reads better than Milrow. Carson who? Beck. UGA's Man, quarterback. that bastard ain't nothing, man. <laughs> you don't like that. He don't boy, like man. it. No, it ain't all like it. <laughs> bro, I just know what they gonna end up doing after they leave school. Okay, I feel you. I feel you on that. Yeah. Hold the clipboard for a few man, years. Man, come on. Man, yeah, yeah, I'm yeah, yeah, telling yeah. you, if Georgia had a mobile quarterback or something, uh, just get a quarterback. Yeah. Just get a quarterback, he, man. He executing now. I, I trust me. You got to understand how much pain that runs through my veins when I even compliment anybody from down there. But the man do good. He executes. He he does what he's supposed to do. And you can't deny what the hell they did um, this past weekend, bro. That was that was against that Florida was State. Because at, at first I was like, well, Florida State defense, but a lot of they de they yeah, were playing they, against third stringers too, though. Really. 60 points, bro. I don't care what you, I don't care where yeah, you are, that's what true level. Too. And it was a home points. game for Florida on, State. Man, they said Florida points. State should have been playing uh, DeVry. <laughs> <laughs> I seen them talking about that. I said, man, now they're going too far. But if I'm the Florida State coach, bro, I know we resting, and I know I got third stringers out there. I'd rather nobody even go back on the field. Y'all don't get y'all ass whooped like that. Just stay, just walk, walk on. That's how you make a statement. Don't play. Because yeah, they was, didn't play. That was ugly. That was ugly. Washington, quarterback Michael Penix should have won Heisman. I like that. And I like, <laughs> I like, I like that, that LSU quarterback. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, but once damn. you watch it, bro, the man is so poised. It's he don't get impressive. rattled. Very impressive. He old. Shit. Yeah, I didn't know. Man, he said, you know, oh, bro, McDaniel's Knicks. I don't, don't, be, start a minute, I don't be knowing until the commentator start started talking. The commentator said, "Yeah, after his four years at Indiana." I said, four years at Indiana." Yes. <laughs> boy, yes. those niggas using that COVID today, boy. Well, he he, he been hurt a lot in his career, man. So he's had a lot of but like, I'm still glad he done shook back. Yeah. But he's supposed to be playing on Sunday. Right now. And, yeah. Right now. Not because of his talent. I'm talking because of age. <laughs> And he's the one letting all naysayers know. Michael Penix is letting all na naysayers know Link. Yeah. Nah. That, I like uh, Mil Mil yeah. Hey. <laughs> 2024, man. It's a new year. You know what that means? It's time to get some new money. If you're not on prize picks, 
What you waiting on? Go sign up right now. Use our code BROKENPLAY. Whatever you put up, they going to match up to $100. So if you put up $83, that's all you got left after Christmas shop, we not here to judge you. But they going to match them $83. Now you can come in and put how many ever more or less you want on your favorite players. You think they're going to score 25 points? More. You don't think they're going to score 25 points? Less. Pick up six. Up to 25 times your money. What you waiting for, man? It's available in over 30 states. Two to six players. Any sports. We got college football coming down to the last game, national championship. We got playoffs coming up with the NFL. We got NBA, peak season, college basketball. Man, stop playing and come get your money. Prize picks. It's the way. You say you want money for the 2024. How you want money and you ain't signed up for prize picks? Come get some money, man. Tell them Nav Green sent you from Broken Play. They want to blame Milro against uh, that Michigan game. Bro, you got to blame that center and that offensive coordinator. I don't know what plays they start right. running. Man, that look like a 9 you. <laughs> not, Welcome not, all not. football team out there. Now, this is the one time I might disagree with you. What? Man, he just ain't got it. You don't think he got it? Nah, he's not a quarterback. And, and that show, we were talking earlier, it's impressive for them to even be in the playoffs, given Nick Saban ain't have a quarterback. Remember South Florida, they, would play, they had a boy play quarterback. We still got that transferred from Notre Dame. You don't know his name, right? Right. So he was starting at Alabama, and then Milro won that job by default. Man, he's not a quarterback. And he, what, what, what can he play, really? Uh, he can play a lot of other things. <laughs> there's a wide receiver, there's a running back, there's DBs, and there's special teams all over the field. <laughs> but I'm telling you, from what I saw, especially during that Michigan game, he, he just he doesn't understand concepts very well. What is one key play that stood out to you pertaining to him and not understanding concepts? Um, that third, well, it was two plays. That third down before the last drive, the third down where he missed the read where he should have pulled and hit the guy in the flat, and the fourth down play on the quarterback draw, he had a crease. But what he did was he was not poised enough to say, all right, let me read. If I have to bounce it a gap or two over to the left to where I can run it and walk into the end zone, I, I got it. But what he did was say, man, I'm about to run right here as fast as I can. And that's exactly what he did. That's why it looked like a welcome all play. Mm-hmm. But it is what it is. But, okay, saying that, J.J. McCarthy didn't show me nothing either, though. The Michigan nah, quarterback. not at all. And they praised him so much. That's why the game was so close. Left and right. That's why the game was so close. Yep. They, they, them quarterbacks are doing this right here. <laughs> Which one is yeah. more mediocre? Uh -huh. To be honest with you. But I think, Mil what, what Miro is, a sophomore? He is a... That's a good question. Yeah, sophomore. I think he got a chance. All right. Well, if, he, <laughs> if he take it serious, because look, in some games you see him play like, bro, but they got a receiving court, and I'm like, why are they not getting the playmakers the ball? Now, if he can't see that, man, I'm telling you. he. I, again, I could be wrong. I'm not, I'm not an expert, but from what I see and from what I took, especially from this past weekend, he may not understand the concepts well. That's why his, the play calling was limited. It damn near looked like a triple option team out there in the Rose Bowl versus Michigan, to be honest with you. Every successful player was him literally taking down, taking off. So with us seeing that, Reggie, why Georgia couldn't stop? Good question. You know, that's, that, they say that's like one of them curses for them, for them Bulldog faithfuls. Like, they, they can't get over the hunt with Alabama. So it could be some of the intangibles mixed it's in like, with it. It's like, I don't know yeah. if Nick Saban just look over there at Kirby a certain way and Kirby just get, or he got something on him. Because you know they was on the same coaching yeah. staff, yeah. maybe yeah. at a party, he got little pictures and videos. Like, <laughs> I hate to send it to your wife. <laughs> we got to win this one. What you talking about, coach? Hey, don't coach me. <laughs> I got the email right now. I don't put it past nobody, bro. I don't put it past nobody. Draft. And I see, I see, see your mother-in-law. Like, like, them white folks, they get nasty. Yes, they do. Man, but I do think... I'm not mad at either game, though. Great games. Two, great games. Two great games. What about Oregon versus Liberty? Oh, waste of time. 
God damn. Why would, why would they do liberty like that? Liberty, yeah, that was Liberty undefeated, bro. Nah, bro. They did not. Nah, there's levels. Nah, there's levels. Nah, there's levels, bro. Bro. There's nah levels. stop. Like, cut that out. Some some situations. See, this is this is where the committee can, or whatever committee picks these bowl games, mm -hmm. this is where they get me messed up. How you not put Georgia in the Final Four, but you'll stick Liberty up against uh, Oregon? Oregon. And Oregon, only two losses was to Washington. So they arguably could be one of the ones in the Final Four, if not one of the first ones out. That ain't that ain't right. That's why they expanded it next year to I believe twelve. Yeah, so, next year. Yeah. It's gonna be well, do you think that's too many though? That's gonna make money now. Yeah, that's money. That's, that's, what, that's all they care fine. about. Never that's that's why Alabama was in it. It was that's about gonna, money. There you go. I'm with you on that. But it was yeah. about money. But Georgia, I feel like uh, Georgia's fan base is strong too. I know Alabama. is I think maybe a little stronger. Alabama fan base. Yeah, a little strong. Can't be compared to. Did you see, bro? When they out there, no. man, if you could get them country people to come all the way to California, <laughs> Pasadena, bro. man, when they, when they scan that camera, it looked like it was an Alabama home game to Michigan start winning. Then they were like, they found that section. Mm -hmm. I was like, why ain't even know that many Michigan people out there? No, I feel did. like, so who you got? Michigan versus Washington. I like Phoenix, man. I got to go with him. I ain't, I ain't going to lie to you that he was so impressive to me. Over the weekend, it was almost like I think he went on a run where he was just twelve for twelve. Yeah, and this wasn't just starting the third quarter. Yeah, yeah. so uh -huh. it, and he wasn't just sitting in the pocket. He was having to move around, having to sight adjust, watching uh, 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 pressures and everything like that, or adjusting the pressures and everything like that. But now nah, he was impressive. I mean, he wasn't throwing screen routes or flat oh. routes to running backs. He, he throwing that motherfucker all over the field. Man, right? hey, I'm gonna tell you this, Ray. They gotta run the ball though. If they don't run the ball, they gonna be in trouble. Cause it's like, I feel like they, even with clock management at the end of that game. Yeah. When they was throwing, bro, just just run. You know, yeah. Johnson got hurt at the end of the game. So they gotta change that rule, bro. I don't know. They gotta change that rule. What rule? Oh, cause the clock wasn't running. I'm like, yo, they give him the chance to uh, Texas to win this game. It was 45 seconds. The running back on third down went down. He was hurt. Yeah, you hurt. So they had to stop the clock. No, you, that, no, they nah, can't change that rule, nah. man. <laughs> once you get everything set, oh, and you, you start to play the clock, clock you need it. to start that game clock as well. You that 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 serves as a timeout if crazy. I get hurt. <laughs> that's ugly, man. I don't like hey, that. They gotta change that's that. That's why you see some of them, they'll crawl off the field. <laughs> but I don't think Buddy can move. I nah, think they had to carry yeah. him off. I hope he be straight. Yeah. They they gonna be hey, straight into NFL. I don't want nobody to question this or say nothing else about it. Give Lamar Jackson the MVP now. Hands down. Hands down. It's not even close, bro. Hands it's down. Not. What he did against Miami? They won 56 to 19. That, that was a statement game. Yeah, they, uh, he threw five touchdowns, went 18 for 21, 321 yards. They look unstoppable, bro. And they say he ain't no quarterback. No, they not ain't quarterback say that no more. They ain't say that. Yeah, no, like this, somebody like girl just said he, like he, he's not quarterbacky. That's it, yeah. Yeah, that's what she said. Recently? Yeah. Yes. Because <laughs> yes. they were talking about MVP. She said, he he's just not quarterbacky. Who said that? I couldn't tell you the yeah, lady's name. Yeah, I don't know her name. Quarterbacky? Quarterbacky was the term. Mm -hmm. Man, speaking with Lamar should be MVP. What's going on with Jalen Hurts? Oof. What you think? What you think Oof. the biggest problem is, right? Because he got the weapons. Uh I think they done changed his style of play. Right, look, man, I know this might be polarizing to say, but I don't like a quarterback that does not show emotion. And you know, it'll be times where Jalen Hurts is just so cool, calm, and collected. Bro, you gotta talk to somebody. You gotta, you gotta show something. And I'm not saying that has anything to do with it. Yeah. But to bottle up that emotion and bottle up that shit all the time, it's got to come out of some way, form or fashion, whether it's going to be productive or counterproductive. Man, I just think it's a lot of pressure on the man's shoulders, for real. But And he in Philly? Shit, he didn't pay to do it, though. Yeah, they lost four out of five, man. Four out of five. That to kick, lose to the Cardinals? Dog. Hey. I, I wish I had that. <laughs> Kyle Murray. Whatever you want to say about him, that bastard not going to give up. Do it, bro. <laughs> He's very slept on. Yeah. Very slept on. He's not on. giving up. We're talking about drafting a QB. Like, y'all don't need to draft a QB. And I like the fact that he's playing right now. 
They ain't got no shot right. in making the playoffs exactly. or anything exactly. like that. You yeah. can easily say, man, let me wait the next year or let me Protect get traded. Protect myself, yeah. And that man going crazy right uh-huh. now. Uh-huh. Trying to win. Right. Right. And that um messing they, up parlays. Messing up parlays. <laughs> Fucking the uh, the Eagles losing guaranteed San Francisco the number one spot. He had he saw the players watching the game, so now mm-hmm. the San Francisco got to buy. And now the Cowboys could win the division. Yeah, they and own they, the conference. They uh, got the they got the tiebreaker if they beat yeah. the Commanders. They gonna man. They gonna beat the dog shit out of the Commanders. That boy CD Lamb. Hold on, Cowboys crazy. win if they they win the division if they win. Yeah, yeah. that's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of playoff scenarios, man. It's pretty crazy. Chiefs won won their division. Man, I'm Shit here to say this. Trash and you know I'm the I'm one of the biggest Pat Mahomes supporters that could be. The Chiefs ain't shit. I don't like them. Man, I, it's it's not even fun watching them no more. You remember when it used to be and you Pat just do something exciting, like, man, bro. It's a real thing with that magic rubs off, bro. That, and a lot of that stuff, you know, he was pulling off for the last two or three years. Or some shit you'll never see before. Yeah. It's just not falling their way right now. Whether it's the drops, well, it, it is it's the all drops. the drops. <laughs> you know for what I'm sure. saying? Bro, so it's literally not dropping. He needs way. some receivers. Mm-hmm. It's so surprising they didn't make a play for D Hop. D Hop would have been solidified what he needed. Yeah. A, a D Hop, even. Bro, Julio, Julio had two touchdowns. <laughs> man, y'all get out of here, man. Man. I love Julio, but come on, man. Really? He is he not a good fit that? in Kansas City. He is not a good fit in Kansas City. Nah. He, nah. They, man, he just needs he, somebody. He went off, and I, again, I love him just like y'all love him. If it ain't who you know, it's Julio. I, I love him, but oh, he is, that, that ain't a fit for them. So I don't know. They need somebody. Yeah. But right now, C.D. Sure. Lamb. C.D. Lamb showing his ass. He went in fantasy leagues for everybody. I'm hey, tight. was that a controversial call? Man, you know that. You know that. You know that from... I just asked, bro. <laughs> man. You getting upset like I made the call. Remember last time I was here? Uh-huh. And I told you how Detroit got hosed in Dallas? Another. This is, this is part two of that saga. That man went to the ref, not only him, but the quarterback, and another lineman went to the ref, they not going over there and say, hey, how you doing for the last play of the game? They going to say, hey, I'm reporting as an eligible receiver. There's video evidence of them going over and having this conference with this guy. I don't understand how they could not make that right. They, they'll, they'll erase a pass interference. They'll pick up a, a, a rough in the passer flag. They'll pick up an intentional ground flag. They had all the tools and all the time and all the knowledge to make that right, and they didn't. And you know why they didn't. I I blame the coach. Well, you here, boy. No, nah, bro, because after, <laughs> oh, bro, just kick it and go to overtime. Okay, I'm with you on that. After they done did, after you didn't get that you play, because nah, no, 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 you said no. you were with. Like... I'm saying I understand okay, what he's okay, saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I still go for two. Even even after you fourth and seven. That's Dan Campbell, though, bro. That's Dan. Campbell. I actually had the luxury of playing beside him. I, I understand what he's doing. He's, yeah, he's just one of those guys. Yeah, there, right? he's just one of those guys. I get what he's doing. And then on top of that, man, we go to overtime, play another eight, ten minutes. Shit, that's that's risk, risking somebody getting hurt. But yeah. I, but uh, you were talking earlier with me about how like the um head coaches plan with the refs before. Can you um, talk about that a little so bit? So before every game, uh huh, high school, college, NFL, you meet with the head coaches meet with the referees. This is the time that you discuss. Anything they might go crazy in the game. This is where you talk about your trick plays. Mm. And um, I saw a former head coach, uh, Rex Ryan, even said, sometimes we draw the plays up. So there's no confusion when it happens. Everybody know the fake punt to where if I got a guy lined up on the sideline blending in with the, with the bench players, okay, I need to be aware of that. So the head coach would take that time to make them aware of that. And anything else that might come up that's tricky, you uh-huh. know what I'm saying? Even eligible, or excuse me, not eligible, but linemen reporting as eligibles. They go over this before the game. So for that to happen, on top of them still reiterating the fact that, hey, man, I'm an eligible guy. You know what I'm saying? Without being obvious about right. it. You know what I'm saying? Reggie. I hear you. Emmy Johnson just got the ring on. <laughs> yeah. They in Dallas. Yeah. Jerry, this is the top of the year. 
Jerry got money like a motherfucker. <laughs> they not finna lose that one. We know why this happened. <laughs> Ring we know why this happened. <laughs> hey. I just hate my dogs went down like that. Well, they still, they still good. They playoff, man. Yeah, man, but that, they could have got a buy. They could have, they could have That meant buy. something, bro. For them to go down and win that game, that 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 meant something for for, for Detroit. They would have been number two seed for sure. Absolutely, got a buy. Yeah. So that was a very important game. Now who's gonna get the uh, I think Dallas, Cowboys? Could, Dallas get... is number two right now in the NFC. Dang. Mm-hmm. They need that buy. Yeah, and um, Detroit is three. But after watching Detroit, Detroit gonna give a lot of people problems. I like them, man. Right now, I like them a lot. Right now, they would face the Rams in the playoffs in the wild card. Hey, the Rams is not no pushover. They getting healthy too. Oh yeah, that's Stafford. He'll come back to Detroit, right? Yeah, it'll be. Yeah. they wanted to make that happen. That storyline. Now nah, that would be good though. Yeah, I like that storyline. Yeah, I like the Lions. Golf, in there. golf, golf going golf against, against the Rams. Rams. There you yeah. go. There you go. Yeah. They- Oh yeah, there is a point. Now, now he's even even more rigged. There you go. <laughs> he's even more rigged. <laughs> we know now. why you got. We know why they would have been the two seed. We know why they would not seen that storyline. Had to throw that flag, bro. Dang. Let me make this right. Y'all Falcons lost this weekend. Y'all, I'm not a Falcon. When I say y'all, we're talking to the viewers, my son. Oh, okay. Relax. <laughs> no, nah, I love the Falcons, bro. I'm, I'm with them, bro. <laughs> what? What? We what, can keep going. What bro. it is, <laughs> bro? I, you want? For real? Yeah. That church. When we had to break down <laughs> that church, bro. I'm telling you, bro. That might be it, bro. I'm telling you. I think it's something behind it. That. that that curse had us not draft Justin Fields when we had a chance to draft him. Uh it's it's numerous Super games Bowl. to where some crazy shit done happened. Don't mention no, nah, that was before the Super Bowl. Yeah, the Super Bowl, yeah, that's right. That was when they were building it, right? Yep. Mm-hmm. Come on, man, don't get me started. <laughs> I yeah, just depend. Arthur Smith got to go. At, at this point, I just depend on the Falcons to do Falcons things, and I end up on the right side of whatever bet I make. They still can make the uh, playoffs, man. Who they? Who they? They play the Saints. They got to beat the they Saints. Have to and beat the, the Saints. Saints and lose. Tampa Bay have to lose for them to clinch the South. Get out of here! I know they still. I ain't know they were still. I don't want to see neither one of them teams <laughs> play. Shit, who you want to win the South then? It's out of them three? Bro, just let them sit out this year. <laughs> <laughs> let them get a bye. Oh, Honestly, because it's like, when you watching, bro, Tampa Bay, I had Tampa Bay against the Saints. Me Saints too. go out there Me and too. win. Crazy. They Baker really Mayfield been too. looking good all these games. Then you play the Saints. Stunk it up. Any given Sunday, bro. Telling. Man, what you think about how they doing Russell Wilson? That is fucking tragic. That's tragic. But Sean Payton set that tone early. As soon as he got there. It, it, people go back and, and and watch and remember all the reports and everything he was saying when he first got there. Uh-huh. Even at the shots at Russell Wilson. He made it clear, man, I'm he he's not my guy. You know what I'm saying? Uh and for the franchise quarterback to be benched for the last two games just for monetary uh, reasons, man, that's... And they not hiding it. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah, they are very crazy. blatant with it. It's That's 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 tragic, bro. And it's not like the guy was playing bad. No, nah, he was having they, a solid... Yeah, his numbers were kind of better yeah, than Patrick Mahomes. Yeah, started when he won a five-game five winning Five games in a row, right? I just don't... I don't, I don't agree with it. I think it's, 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 it's horrible, but it's one of those situations to where... The powers that be are going to remind you that they are the powers that be. How often does this happen, though, Rich? Like in the in the uh, league and stuff like that. Good, because this is more noticeable. Yeah. But you know, I know it sometimes where it's like even like with maybe a receiver got to get a certain amount of catches yeah. through the game plan, go away from him, not getting. Or if you're in favor, it goes to you. Mm. Let's say if a guy needs three catches to make the uh, uh, to get his incentive. And, and, and he's loved throughout the organization. Oh, he's going to get them three catches. It might be one of those pitch situations to where he's in motion and, you know, one of them cheat little passes mm-hmm. they do now. Uh, but then again, if it's a guy they're trying to get out the door, i.e. Russell Wilson, man, go and sit down. Let's save whatever money we can. Let's make sure we, pro- we protect this asset, which is a 
pretty good, experienced Super Bowl winning quarterback uh -huh. and be able to, you know, uh, capitalize on whatever value we have after the season. I mean, it's a smart business move. You know what I mean? It is. Yeah. You can't, can't deny that. But at the same time, you just hate to see a guy who we all know this guy straight up and down, just a good guy. Yeah. Bro, good family man. For real, bro. He don't curse. Nah. Take care of his kids. Take care of future sons. Everybody's <laughs> kids. Yeah. <laughs> bro. And then you, you can't even get along with your coach. Yeah. I hate to see that though. Yeah, but they're gonna um they're gonna owe him 142 million. So he's like, he good, he good. What could he go if, if, if we leave them? People are saying the Falcons, the Giants. No, he better not. No, I hope they don't. Uh, those do are that, the top man. two teams I've been seeing, Falcons and Giants. I hope they don't do that shit. We need somebody to create a splash. Falcons bro. rise up. Don't, man. I ain't gonna say it. Please don't jinx us, bro. <laughs> bro, I don't know where he could go though. Giants would be a good fit. Nah, I don't know. Nah. I mean, it's they, they need a quarterback. Yeah, they with need Saquon. a quarterback. Yes, yeah, you're right. I'm but gonna say everybody. Ain't gonna but pay the him that much. I'm gonna say everybody. But what but about the, the Commanders? How they like how, bro? No way. They like how? You think they like him like that? Did they pay him? He's still on his rookie contract. He's only his second year, but damn, that's right. He um he can throw the ball, bro. <laughs> like he's lead, he was leading the NFL in passing yards. Damn. He's young, bro. Like he got a rookie contract. You're right. They're gonna keep him. They gonna get that bang for that buck yeah. for sure. <laughs> Again, business. Mm hmm. Yeah, I don't know. That's it. But just to cut him though, hey, like man. you don't got nothing. Like, what's your plan, Sean Payne? You don't have nobody else waiting in the wing. Only scenario I see working out for them is they just do like an even swap with Fields in Chicago. You think but, he want Justin Fields? But that's what I, that's why I, I came like I had like a little roadblock. Fields ain't his type of quarterback either. Yeah. You what is what his quarterback though? White a pocket. Yeah. What? 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 I don't like nigga quarterbacks. <laughs> you can just hear him in the owner's office screaming. Well, what is he doing? His passing percentage is up. Mm. His touchdowns are good. He, he's doing. He learning the offense that you. Ah, fuck it. The cat's out the bag. I don't like nigga quarterbacks. I don't like naysaying quarterbacks. <laughs> oh man. I hated Jameis and I hate him. I need Heisman Breeze win. back. I thought you just hated Jameis because he stole. No, I hate him because he was a nigga. <laughs> Man, it's all signs pointing to something. Man, For if sure. you turn around and have a white quarterback that first week, man, they might as well go ahead and see it, man. Mm -hmm. man. It'll happen. Dolphins versus Bills for the ace AFC East title. Who y'all got? I'm going to take Bills. Uh, who, uh, who's at home? Miami's home. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We talked about that. I like Miami. I like Miami. This is like, like make or break. The and, and the reason why I like Miami, they coming off a, a, after a loss. And I'm talking about a beat. Bear. There you go. Nigga, Tyreek finna go to slap crazy. Yeah, I like Miami, man. All hey, right. Miami got a lot of fast ass players. They're running back. All over the field. Bro, they All running back. The you saw him? Bro, they running back fast as shit. A-chain. See, man, what the hell? Yo, Tyreek, man, like dropping passes, bro, like. Dropping touchdowns, bro. I'm going to tell you, this is what it is, though. Baltimore hits. You got to brace yourself. So he ain't just like, I'm going to catch and slide. That motherfucker might be sliding with you. <laughs> <laughs> like, they be hitting out there, bro. Baltimore's on a whole nother level. They don't wear no sleeves on defense. They just <laughs> out there. Yeah, they, 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 they on the roll right now. They have a, I'm not saying this, calling them this. But they have a nigga team. <laughs> like, this is a nigga team. Like, bro, we, don't, we ain't on all that. Fan, no. Hey, Zay Flowers? For real. Nice. He is for real. For real. Who he, else is up for rookie of the year? Uh, I think it's Puka. Who? Got, <laughs> got, Puka got that sold up. Mm. Puka Nakua? Mm. Oh, what are you, who are you playing for? What? The Rams. Receiver? That's that West Coast shit. Bro, I don't be watching this game, bro. <laughs> hey, that's that West Coast shit. Yeah, that, I ain't going to watch it. I'm never going to down you for watching stats and looking yeah, at absolutely. Bro, he, he I'm not on. watching no damn on. Rams game, bro. <laughs> Hold on. What's and I used to like Rams. Uh, 
BYU. Cause I like Aaron Donald. Get the fuck out of here. Pull his stats up. What he What he doing? Puka Nakua, like he 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 killing I'm this year. How you know these niggas? Yeah. Fantasy, uh-huh. bro. He kicking my ass. Oh, nigga, how can we forget CJ Stroud? Yeah, that's what I was thinking about. Stroud. Stroud. That, that's yeah, Stroud. Yeah, that's Stroud. Right. That's yeah. Don't got. even look Stroud. whoever you said Stroud. up. Because you wasting your time. CJ Stroud getting Stroud. that. CJ Stroud. It's a quarterback, yeah. Yeah, CJ Stroud getting that. Easily. So we got, so Marcel say the Bills, we say the Dolphins. Who you got, Greg? I'm going to Bills. All right, we'll see. We shall see. Pistons finally get a W. What up, though? Shout out to Coach Detroit. Coach Nav. Hey, I'm going to tell you what it is, bro. <laughs> when you watch Detroit, it, they, they coach too nice. Flint Tropics, baby. Bro, the coach too nice. Flint Tropics. Coach too nice, bro. Monty's a nice guy, man. He's been through a lot. <laughs> but they was up on Boston. 17, Bruh. 18 points. Boston money hey. line at halftime. Hey, but I took that live money line too. <laughs> I swear it I did. wasn't even that high though. That's a crazy hey. thing. Because they, they knew. Hey. They knew. <laughs> Man. But the money line when they beat Toronto wasn't that high either because, like, it's the trade. Like, they mm. OG was gone. Like, they had three of their players gone. Um, it was a, That was an easy. Like, that was hey, easy. what about that trade though? The Knicks won that trade for sure. I don't know if it moves the needle for the Knicks, but man, that, hey, buddy, be locking up. OG, OG, yeah, he had Ant Man a little shook, and you know that's my and, boy. And had thirty six, bro. What are you talking about? Yeah, he got no points. <laughs> he got that points when OG go to the bench. Yeah, OG wasn't. Uh-huh. Yeah, I was watching him. <laughs> hey, hey, yeah, I had Minnesota minus one. And look at you. That's why you mad. <laughs> Somebody do he move the needle, nigga? Yeah. We'll see though. Since Ja been back, Ja been the best shooting guard in the league. Man, I hope he stay. I hope I hope he do the right thing. He's so <laughs> I'm excited. Say, what hey, you man, gonna I'm, say? What? Nah, I, I, oh, stay the course. Oh, I, I hope been he say, stays he on the, the fuck course. Shit still. <laughs> I know, but I hope he somebody get in his head. Just help. You see, he ain't been on Instagram since. Everybody got flip phones around him. You. <laughs> That's hard. Yeah. I don't know if he bullshitting or not. No, 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 no. He got a flip phone deal. Like, it's an endorsement. It's somewhere. Uh, I forget. Wait it's a like minute. some Nokia flip phone. So, like, they just showing the flip phone, and he get to keep his guns. Boy, that's hard. First game back, hit a game winner. That was awesome. Yeah, so at, in New Orleans. Yeah, versus the Pelicans. Versus yeah. the Pelicans. They won um, four straight. Four straight. Now they lost three straight. Mm-hmm. So... He didn't play in Denver. I thought that was pretty funny. He didn't play in Denver because that's when the first shit started up in the street. Oh, no, nah, he ain't gonna play in Denver. That y'all was funny. Nah, as shit. He ain't gonna play in Denver. He's still mad at them about that shit. He's still gonna be spinning and spinning. <laughs> <laughs> they got San Antonio tonight, so they should get back on the winning track. Hey, the Lakers, Basura, have been three and eight since the end season tournament. They cheated the hell out of LeBron. That was a three point shot. It okay. looked like it, Reggie? but it, his, his toe was on the line when he lifted up. Hey man, I'm on not I'm not questioning the refs. I'm not questioning the instant replay. If his foot is on the line, his foot is on the line. You can't. Hey, if you got a side twenty one foot, bro, you just got to deal <laughs> with it. Damn. And I'm I ain't gonna lie, bro. I'm I'm kind of over the the Lakers the late show, bro. I'm I, I'm I'm one of the ones that's tagged out, and I'm I'm done with the late show. It do, should they fire Darvin Ham? He ain't got nothing to do with it. Nah, bro, bro. Why you on me, bro? We we got we got young youthful talent in this league that's taking over this league. Man, yield to those guys. And I ain't saying I'm not trying to out nobody. I'm not trying saying nobody is. is Reggie is, Lebron is still one of the best players in the league. Arguably. Yeah, arguably, arguably for sure. Arguably. Who would argue that? A lot, a of, lot folks. of people. So, all right, I'll just say, you don't think he top five? No. I answer that real fast. And I don't I even like basketball he's, he's like top, that, man. You know Reggie, just name me five players you think better than him. Uh, Gilchrist, Alexander, that boy in OKC. Gilchrist. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Tatum. My boy Tatum. 
I like Morant. I like Jalen Brown and uh, uh, Joker. Bruh, LeBron's not on the fucking court with them. I love LeBron. Don't get me wrong. I got LeBron. I got a LeBron jersey. My brother love LeBron. <laughs> so I'm, you ta- I'm, you, I'm, I'm you, with you taking those people in the game seven over LeBron? All those people you name? Yes. No, I'm not doing that. Yes. You taking LeBron. Tatum and Jalen Brown over Tatum. LeBron? I'm not taking Jalen Brown. I'm taking Tatum for sure. I like my boy LKC. I don't, I don't, SGA. SGA. Nah, I ain't gonna Shane lie. Shane Gilgis. Uh, SGA. Uh, I, I see. Hold on. He MVP. I guy. like Morant. Like. Nah, I, Morant ain't there yet. Man, you tripping? You tripping? Morant Bro. Ain't there yet. Who else? Buy Darlingham <laughs> and get you a player in there. Dog, nah, man. Like, give these, you gotta give these coaches some time, bro. Like, the, the span of coaching is like, it's so, Marcia, everywhere. I, I, understand. I, I will agree with you on I that. Understand you I understand you saying that. I will agree with you on like, that. Come on. But the first week, I, I knew this. It was the first game when LeBron had to tell the coach, you know, I could play point guard, right? If I'm telling, he not the coach for me. Mm. I might as well coach this damn team myself. And that's what LeBron, LeBron ain't respecting them since. But is, is that a good thing to call your coach out like that? Man, bring Mark Jackson in there. That's not happening. Mark, Mark Jackson. Jackson. Why, why you want to give Mark Jackson a job? Because he with Cameron. He was a killer. Sign the deal. He good. Mark Jackson underground, man. He ain't even going yeah. mainstream no more. Yeah, he done. Mm. That's what it looks like. He's not, even getting, inter- he not even getting interviews, which is crazy, but. Literally built that dynasty out there. Yeah. Started it. And speaking of that, what they need to do? They two games on the 500. Fire same Steve thing. <laughs> same thing. They, they fall in the same boat with me as the Lakers. Like, it's just, you know, shout out y'all had y'all run, man. It was a great run. Yeah. I don't think they should have gave Wiseman up. I remember Wiseman. Damn, forgot about him. They won without him, Detroit. bro. They won without him. But I'm him. saying, no, when I say give him up, give him time to develop. You talking about get a coach of time, they don't get the players time to develop. That's real. They got some talent over there. What's your boy, Kamunga? He, he can play. <laughs> Kaminga. Whatever. And, and he know who I'm talking about. <laughs> Nigga, you can play. If you watch this, you can play. Tell your coach you can play. But they scared to tell the coach they can play. They just miss, they missing Draymond, bro. He's kind of the glue, bro, to make the engine run no a question. Bit better for sure. No question. Yeah. No question. Jordan Poole, bro. He's having a shitty year. Yeah, because he don't want to be in Washington. He chilling. He that got con- got that, some money. Bro, that continuity is 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 a real thing, bro. Yeah. Once you start moving pieces and think you're gonna fill somebody else in with with just a, uh, I don't know, I guess a talented guy, a more attractive guy, whatever. You know what I mean? It's it's not gonna work. That continuity is real. Yep. And it's off. And if you had there. to pick really? one player right now coming out of college, like say for instance, Chicago had a number one pick. Who you going with? At a, a basketball? Football. Football. Yeah. Ooh. And who's coming? the team? Chicago. Chicago. Has a one pick. Chicago got a number one pick. Do they, they go did. away from Justin Fields and go with Caleb Williams? That's, hell no. Okay. I, I, I don't understand <laughs> why. Why is it a question of Justin Fields returning tonight? How the hell you not Bro, make that man your talking. franchise quarterback? They, 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 they going away from him. That's crazy. Reg, I'm telling you what they finna do. They going away from him. That 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 they were chanting his name like the fans. That's were. crazy. Uh, but if they are going uh, uh, away from him, I'm not drafting Caleb Williams. His stock plummeted this year. Bro, oh God. watching Bro. Caleb Williams this year, I was like, boy, you plummeted. might need to come back. I'm going with Phoenix. I'm going with three other quarterbacks before I go with Caleb Williams, to be honest with you. What three now? I ain't going to say three. Phoenix? Uh-huh. I would go with Bo Nix before Caleb Williams. Man, Bo Don't Nicks. do that, dog. Don't do that. Stop. Stop. I said, now, I'm doing this. I said before now. I, I'm, I'm, sorry. I'm not saying Bo Nix is the, 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 I'm not. Don't do All that, right. man. But you asked me who I'm going with before Caleb Williams. Cause Bo Nix going to end up playing inside linebacker. When he get to a team, <laughs> man, they going to say, boy, man. get your ass on defense. It's just going to be like, I'm remember the Titans when they just start putting players where they really should have been. Yeah. <laughs> Bo Nix never was supposed to be no damn quarterback, bro. Man, you got, hey. But uh, who's another one? Uh, Drake May. Jaden Jaden Dan- Daniels. I do like Jaden Daniels. See, Jaden Daniels, yes. May, no. Yeah, May. I don't believe in him. May ain't gonna be man. May gonna be just like your boy up there in New York. Which one? Daniel Jones. Not shit. Trubisky. 
Oh, no, I don't buy I'm telling you. But I'm telling you. Yeah, that's me. You're just saying that because Trubisky went to North Carolina. That's why. They in the same boat. That's why. The last three quarterbacks out of UNC are the same. Sam Howell? Is the same. He's better than Mr. Trubisky. I get that. A notch, maybe. A notch. Drake May. Drake May is going to be all right. I feel like, uh, but they got I, a, I my draft that. still got Caleb going number one, man. I That's, don't understand that. You know that shit ain't real. Um, even like when the USC when they played, um, who they play in the bowl game? And they drilled them. They drilled um, them. Boy threw from six touchdowns. Who that? USC. The backup quarterback for USC. Fuck, I forgot. Who oh, hey, that, who was that? It's a backup quarterback. They uh, was that for Tennessee? Oh, he yeah. hard. Yes. That freshman. Yeah. He's he tough. He has comparisons like uh, Jordan Love. But uh, uh, the back, the, uh, I saw uh, USC, one of the uh, one of the players was like, we a team now. We a team they now. They were saying that shit the whole yeah. game. Yeah. Because, you know, Caleb ain't playing. Like, I just seen like Caleb was, he got, he was like, maybe they felt like he was bigger than Louisville. the team and shit. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. They drilled Louisville. Goodness gracious. But you got to think, he getting all that NIL money. Commercials, you see him on all, the, all the commercials. Dr. Pepper commercials, everything. Man, them niggas come around right here like, man, I ain't trying to talk about that <laughs> shit y'all talking about, man. I'm trying to see y'all. If he did what he's supposed to do, he should have that team on lock. And for I, sure. That, that, that's, They'll be ready to run through a brick wall for him. That crying shit he did, let me know something was off. Bro, you don't go into the stands and cry with your mama after a football game. <laughs> on now, if you inside the locker room in the bathroom by yourself... Yeah, bro, yeah. Not, not, not with your mom on national TV, bro. You, you, he lost me on that shit. Bro, he, he probably selling a story, bro. You never know, Rich. It's always well, about you know money with that Hollywood. nigga, man. That yeah. is Hollywood. Yeah, there in Hollywood. Now they got a movie on Lifetime. There you go. <laughs> the there last go. cry. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. No, nah, man, you got to watch that ass for real. Marvin Harrison Jr., they got him ranked number three coming up. Deserving. He deserve it. That's who should, Chicago should drive. Give Justin Fields some pieces. Now, I'm going to tell you this. The only thing I do love about Philadelphia, they put pieces around Jalen Hurts. Now it's just, I don't know. You got to do it. You got to make some yeah. shake. Give, give Justin Man, Fields some pieces. It's still crazy to me how they want to ship him out of there. Man. I don't, I don't get it. I, they got if so Justin much Fields had them pieces that they got in Atlanta, they got so much. Uh, Chicago has so much leverage. They can trade that number one pick, get more draft picks. They can trade Justin Fields to the Falcon. Like this is where you see the difference between organizations and why this organization wins and why this organization doesn't win. Baltimore, uh, Philly, uh, Pittsburgh, they know how to move pieces around to make this shit work. Yeah. If you got a centerpiece like Justin Fields, bro, it's no. That's the biggest question mark on any football He's team. Like, that's like one of your favorite quarterbacks, huh? Which one? Justin Fields. Man, I was mad as hell we didn't draft him. Real? Yes. Uh, his I'm... rookie year, he showed me a lot, even though they ain't win much at all. Uh -huh. But he's one of the ones, the Vic-esque, you know what I'm saying? He'll change a game in one or two plays. This Reggie, after watching him when he went to Ohio State, that's when I realized Georgia do not like black quarterbacks. <laughs> you better believe it. DJ not... Shockley. Bro, I did not know. You waited for three years, bro. <laughs> I did not know Justin Fields could throw. Every time they put Justin Fields in a game when he was at Georgia, it would just be a run. I'm like, can he throw? The boy went to Ohio State, first game through a 70 yard pass. I said, Georgia racist. You know what Georgia did one time with Justin Fields? Put him in on a fake punt in a punt formation. Of course, they ain't get it. That's, that's when I was like, yeah, it's something to this. They're trying to sabotage. They put him down, you know, the fullback, the blocker, the personal protector mm -hmm. for the punter. They put Justin Fields right there and went for a fake. As if nobody would guess that this is a fake. That's a quarterback close on. Jake Fromm was in front of him? Yeah. Mm hmm Jake Fromm was solid, man. Where he at now? I don't know. Exactly, bro. That's all. <laughs> I'm telling you, bro. <laughs> These white college quarterback, they give them, they, like, Bro, come on, man, y'all. It's be so, real so, so, talent. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. It be real talent that y'all keeping off the field for somebody who's finna be. I get it. A real estate agent. <laughs> I get it. Or be working at WSB TV. For real? That what they going man. Hey, man. What, what am I to say? We got some comments. <laughs> Yeah, 
Will said, so y'all not going to get prize picks in Cleveland. Look, bro. We don't own this. We don't own prize picks. <laughs> prize picks are a sponsor for the show. <laughs> Nigga, if, if them not being in Cleveland help this show get ran, I hope it never come to Cleveland. <laughs> <That's what laughs> Dry your ass to Kentucky, put your bets in, and drive back to Cleveland. Now, nah, Will, I'm going to work on it this year, bro. I said in 2024, my New Year's resolution, I'm going to start making people around me better. That's what's up. I ain't said <laughs> shit like that. <laughs> Jay Will said, let's get some Lamar Jackson praise around this motherfucker. Man, hey, we just did it. He the MVP. What you want us to say? He better be. Hope he win the Super Bowl, man. Me too, bro. Dang. J Dog 33 said, I got jumped before a football game by my own teammates. God damn. Nigga, them weren't your teammates. <laughs> <laughs> you were somewhere you weren't supposed to be. <laughs> you was on that team by default. <laughs> boy, that's funny as hell. I'm gonna laugh about that all day, boy. Bro, to get jumped <laughs> but before the football game. <laughs> Now that practice, bro, we we finna go for the oh, game. He definitely didn't play. <laughs> hey, bro, you know what type of time you gotta be on with everybody in the greens? They be like, nah, Coach Mike, man, fuck that. He gotta get his ass whooped now. <laughs> Before okay. the game, they, Before the game, right? I want to know who that is. I want to know who that is. J Dog Thirty Three. We need more to this backstory. <laughs> no, for real. Yeah, call the voicemail. Call number, the voicemail number. <laughs> Six seven eight three eight three seven five six two. If you can, bro, send us a video to the Broken Play page. We need to know more to this story. Was y'all winning? What was y'all record? What position you played? Did you get on the field? And nigga, did you play after? Hey man. After I, you got jumped, do you go on the field and yeah. do it? And nigga, how you gonna block for a nigga who just jumped? Yeah, facts. How you pull? <laughs> Where he the guard? I gotta hear that story, bro. I gotta hear it. Damn, J Dog, and you still got your number in your name. <laughs> <laughs> Them nigga gonna come whoop your ass again. Oh, you snitching? <laughs> <laughs> right. <sighs> what it do, Marvin Jones said? Yes, sir. What it do? Broken play, eighty-five percent. A shout out to you. Happy New Year, King. Sheldon Royster said, thank you for reading my comment and granting my Christmas wish. Shout out to the greatest sports podcast, Merry Christmas, gang. That's what it's about. That's awesome, man. Appreciate y'all. Say it, Merry Christmas. WMJ said, Cowboys might fuck around and get to the Super Bowl. Nah, that ain't gonna happen. Bro, I'm hey, a Cowboy fan. Been... <laughs> you are? Yeah. You oh, damn, my bad now. Nah. Uh, <laughs> but they not going to no Super Bowl. It's Dak. Really? Yes. It's Dak. Bro, if you watch Dak, bro, and, and I'm just saying, and I was telling my partner this week, and he was like, nah. He was like, I like that, bro. I was like, just watch him. Yeah. He was like, I see what you're talking about. He threw a pick. <laughs> now, and I ain't saying he can't throw no interceptions. I'm about to say now. He no, he, I know he going to throw picks, but I'm saying, bro, he just... Like how you said, be don't show no emotion for Jalen Hurts. Mm -hmm. That don't show no emotion. He has his moments. He be screaming and shit. Yeah, for no reason. <laughs> he screaming when it's his damn fault. <laughs> oh, man, shut your ass up and go to the sideline and read that damn playbook. Uh, it's all going to follow him, though, for real. Yeah, it so, always yeah. is. But I feel like he got enough weapons where that offense oh, should for be sure. clicking. For sure. I mean, they, they Bro, do, if they at home, they doing their thing. Let me tell you this, Reggie. And it, it seemed good with C.D. Lamb. You should not be throwing to C.D. Lamb no fucking 20 times. Why not? Yeah, why not? Shit. Bro. Shit. You see what I'm saying, Greg? Shit. Yeah, bro, uh, somebody going somebody to lock. They, bro, it's going to finna be a bait. I, I feel you. I understand. Get, get some chemistry with the other receiver, because when they start doubling him in the playoff, now your ass going to be looking silly. Point and a half. I got you on it. Good. I got you. That's on all that. I'm saying. But shit, if I got C.D. Lamb, I'm going to feed him. 20 times? I don't yeah. know about 20. I don't know about How 20. How many times? Look at his targets. targets. I got Bro, he Detroit. Th he got the target uh, yes. 20 times? He had 16 catches, Reggie. One for 92. Five, bro. 
192? He said one for 92 yards. That man was on fire, man. Hey, but no, Reggie. It could be, he just throwing it. He, this man ain't came out and break. Seven, 17 targets, 227 yards, 13 receptions. Oh, no, we rolling, baby. One hey, no, no, <laughs> no. Nah. 13 I, out of 17. That's one of them nights where somebody's just rolling, dog. You got to feel them. All but right. I, I I understand what you're saying about uh, building that chemistry with everybody else. Other receiver. Because you're going to have to go to him well, at some point. Cook's got eight targets and a touchdown. Hey, Cook's be balling. Cook's be balling. You know, Dak loves his tight, tight ends. Jake Ferguson, six targets, four receptions. So. See, that's at home, man. They, that's it's a different home. team Yeah, they at home. home. Always, yeah. Hey, I'm going to say this, Red. Did you watch that whole game? No, I watched the end. Bro, they hold Michael Parsons the whole game, bro. And they got to stop that shit. In some way, we got to write a referee. Bro, if you just watch, Michael Parsons is getting doubled in hell every play. That's part of that conversation with the head coach before the game, too. The head coach is saying, what, what can I get away with? Yeah. Type of conversations. Oh. You know what I'm saying? So Dang. that's a real thing. Or, or, you know what? Belichick, I don't know if anybody else does it, they scout referees. They scout what line judge, what umpire is going to call uh -huh. holding uh, more often than the other. Uh -huh. Which which side judge is going to call off, offsides or how much room I can get. Because it looked like you know Alabama was doing a lot of holding against Michigan if you watch that oh, game. Man, holding every play, you know that. Yeah. They were letting a lot of it go. Yeah. They were letting a lot of it go. We doing prize picks? Voicemails. Oh, we got voicemail playing. <laughs> hey now, go for play, y'all boy. Now I need your ass to learn how to say memorabilia, because you got me riding this whole saying memorabilia all wrong with you. <laughs> then uh, I fuck with y'all boys up there. Uh, another thing, shout out to that now. Uh, I'm down here in South Carolina. Shout out to the girls. Um, college team, they kick your ass. You feel me? Uh, just give them a shout out, bro. Play for you. All right, y'all boy. All right, say that shit though. Memorabilia. <laughs> memorabilia. I'm gonna have it down pat. Memorabilia. It's South Carolina undefeated, man. The girls. Don Staley. Yeah. Oh yeah, she ain't gonna lose. We only had one. Hey, you're Hey, shout out to the Baltimore Ravens, Lamar Jackson and them boy. We just went in San Francisco, cut their ass. But they thought was gonna happen. Hey, hell, y'all got white people playing running back and all this other shit, but we come in that bitch in all black. Black people playing black people position and whoop y'all ass. And the white folks is the kicker and the centers and shit. You feel me? But yeah, shout out Lamar Jackson. He the MVP. The one that said that shout out my resume. Hey. Like the same dude. Now look, <laughs> I'm not going to argue with people when they have, because everybody entitled to their own opinion. But Christian McCaffrey, he a, he a baller. He, he, yes, he's he a he baller. He's different. He a baller. But I do understand. What you getting at? He go crazy for the all white, all white team for sure. Yeah. Him, all white Pro Bowl team. Yeah, he go crazy. Kill. Hey, what's going on? Shout out to Broken Plays, man. Appreciate y'all boys doing y'all thing. Uh, all of the joints be hitting, man. The last one I watched was the interview with Jamal Crawford, then the one with Damon Stoudemire. You know what I'm saying? So uh, appreciate, appreciate the good work, man. Second season of Broken Plays. Hey, bottles of forty two here come, man. Keep up the good work. Proud of y'all boys. And yeah. Yes, sir. We appreciate y'all, man. That 42 on the way for sure. You can tell niggas just get drunk and just call them boys. <laughs> I, think I think it's been pretty yeah, much sober, sober people this yeah. time. This is Rika all the way from motherfucking Texas. Big B. You know what it is. Um, I just wanted to say I hate sports. I'm not interested in them. I don't like them. I don't have no teams. I never play. My nigga don't play. But I love you, Nav. Like, I sit here and watch this shit. Like, it sound like Spanish to me. This shit sound like Russian. This shit sound like Chinese. And I don't give a fuck because you niggas is funny. And I'm going to sit here and I'm going to watch you. And I'm going to kiki. Even though I don't know what the fuck y'all talking about or who y'all talking about. But I love you. I love your guests. I love 85 South. I love you boys. I just want to say that. Love you. Oh, you like my voice? Shooting that shot, <laughs> bro. Turn you off? Shooting that shot, bro. <laughs> that was you doing. Hey, no. Nah, I was outside, though, bro. That's what it's a for, like. We going to talk sport, just talk, like, just talk in general. But it's good when people just can watch it and just get a sense of what they watch. Right. But she lost me. Hey, she two times for Fort Worth, Texas, man. 
Hey, hold on. I know a bunch of niggas done called in and talked about this. Y'all got to stop with this James Harden fuckery. What are we talking? Top five? Y'all can get, y'all get this nigga top five. What the fuck has James Harden done? At any, other than the fuck, no, stop. Nope, stop. You got to stop it. Can't even get it out. There's so much bullshit. You got to stop it. Nigga, disappear in the playoffs. No. Stop. Uh, wrong. He is wrong, bro. Shoot. Shoot. Oh, James Shoot. Harden averaged 30 and 30 plus and 10 for like three or four years straight, bro. Stop oh. it. But it don't mean that. Top 75 player all time. What, what we were just talking about, how Reggie just was making the comparison with Caleb Williams. Like, some people just passed stats. He was just passing stats, bro. bro he You're was not making your team league. better. Dog, they went to the Western Conference Finals on more than one occasion. That they, was because of CP3, bro. They just played, hey. they just played against that the best team That was because of CP3. All right, let's kill Stop all this it. shit right now. Russell Westbrook or James Harden? I'm, going I'm taking James. I'm taking Ooh, Russell Westbrook. Up. I'm taking James. I'm taking Russell Westbrook. Westbrook. Hands down. No Easy. hesitation. Who's starting right now and who's not? They the same age. Man, I, you know. <laughs> <laughs> same age, bro. That's, that's what politics and stuff. Point no, no, no. Nah, James is a better player, bro. Point Marcel. But look, <laughs> bro, Russell is, is, bro, is the guy. See, you just talk, nice. You just talked about 30 and 10. This man, Russell Westbrook, averaged a triple-double for a season. That's what's up, bro. That's so amazing. Look, that's, that's how you amazing. know stats don't matter. That's amazing. When I tell you the same stat, nine what, don't what, matter. What happened? He what? He was an eighth seed, and they lost. Hey. Who that Russell? Yeah, he's by himself though, bro. By himself. Hey, he, by himself. He, he that team wasn't supposed to be in the playoffs. He, Not at he, all. he went on. They put him on the back, but eighth seed. He never been in the conference finals since so you the like Thunder, James bro. Harden. Yeah, I, I just think he's a better young player young than Russell. Oh, you like James Harden too? I just think he's a better player. I like Russ more. All time? Yeah. Oh, okay. for sure. You said all time? Yeah, shooting guards, yes. Okay. Hey, so. You know, it's a combo guard. So, but... final predictions. Right. What we got? Michigan and Washington, what's the final score? Uh, I started off. I like Washington. And I like them lighting up that scoreboard, too. I like them like 31, 35. I say, let's say 31, 13. That's right. Washington. Down. Nah, Michigan going to be able to score now. And I'm going to say this. We talked about I'm going to say this because they're going to run. They're going to run. Uh, I got you. You can run against Washington. I saw that. Texas blew that game. And they would not run the ball. They would not run the ball. They, would they would get the six or seven yards a pop. They then they do a false start. Now you got to throw. They be wanting that white quarterback to look good. And I'm not trying to throw race into it, but that's all it's about, bro. Because if you <laughs> want to win, you're going to do what every... I'm going to tell you this now. People give Nick Saban a lot of credit, and this is why they give him a lot of credit. He will change the game to what he need to win at the time. Damn right. He don't give a damn. He'll bench whoever, switch out quarterbacks to just switch the game out for him. Yeah. I mean, he changed the whole scheme look like of, of, of what Alabama is doing for the last two or three years. Yeah. They became that pound, running pound Man, type team. Man, he'll put shit, you know black I mean? quarterback in there quick. Look, look what Alabama did against Georgia. That's why Georgia wasn't ready for me. They ain't know what to do with him. That was just a bad week for them boys. That was a bad week, bro. It's it was. Good, and I ain't no Georgia fan. It's all good. It's all good, bro. I think Tech helped them out a little bit because I think they let off the gas with Tech. I'm not going to lie to you. If you go watch that game where Georgia played Tech, I think Georgia let off the gas. And that's what they get. Dead ass. Because I had the over. Because Tech, Tech <laughs> was... I love Tech. Y'all know I love yeah. Tech. And I was proud of the performance and everything, proud of the final score, just fighting. But You had the there, game? Huh? You went to the game? No. Nah. They they are three touchdowns better than what what you think what you think Tech miss I like the quarterback for Georgia Tech uh, depth and one of those guys on the outside to go crazy one of those guys that will catch ten passes for two touchdowns and one fifty two hundred yards they missing that one how Georgia Tech had became what receivers wanted to go there that was just some crazy ass coincidence bro wow for real especially in that offense huh? for real well see Calvin. We had an open offense. Yeah. Everybody after that, that was the wing T triple yeah. option. Yeah. Shout out to Paul Johnson. They just lucked up on some shit for real. Yeah, Johnson, bro. Different. And Demarius Thomas. Different. Rest in peace. See, he played in that wing T shit yeah. right after we left. Yeah. He probably didn't want to go far though. He from yeah. He from yeah, he from South Georgia. I yeah, believe. he middle uh like making one around. Something like that, yeah. yeah. What what's your predictions on the game? 
Uh, I got the game being 35-24 Washington. Damn, so I got 30-26 to 26 Washington. I, so we all in agreement with Washington. Yeah. I just don't see, I don't see, unless, unless they, <laughs> boy, shut up. I'm telling you, unless they don't want somebody holding up the trophy. Well, that's, that's why I get an edge to Washington, though, because that quarterback play, it, it ain't no comparison. Yeah. It's no comparison. JJ, bro, JJ's all right, but. How he make his throws. It's so no cool. comparison, bro. He's just dumping down. Bro, and they fall right where they need to be. And that's a six-year vet, bro. Or <laughs> six-year vet. You got, bro. That shit is ridiculous what they're doing with that. Any closing remarks before we get out of here, man? Shout out to Mike Tomlin, man. 17 nine losing seasons in a row. Hi. Yep. Hey. <laughs> uh, and he's the only coach to do that. Yeah. So that's we we watching Black History right, right with no now. No quarterback. Not paying attention. Yeah, he, no quarterback. No so that's quarterback. 17 straight seasons not not having to lose a season as a black head coach in the National Football League. Bro, that should get at least three, four more coaches in the door. I'm glad you just said that. That's where Russell Wilson should go. Nah. Shit. Hey. I don't see them. Damn. That personality. That's what what you mean, personality? Him and Mike Tomlin. I don't think so. That match. I don't think so. Nah, you might, nah. Bro, bro, you might be on something, man. Nah, bro. It With that work. offense, Russell Wilson, he'll do good in that. It wouldn't work, bro. How? Nah, I don't Personalities, know, Personalities, bro. Russ is just... Bro, uh, nobody not matches dog. Russell Wilson's personality. For real. Dog, he's not one of them. He don't seem like a Stiller type player, dog. That's a, like, bro, a he's dog. never been... Like, no, look, he was in... Who curse people out with him. Listen, bro. bro. He was just in Seattle with Richard Sherman, uh, Beast Mode. You think them niggas fit in with him? No. Man, they did not like his ass. Yeah. It just, bro, he'll never, <laughs> he'll never fit in nowhere. The only place he could go where he could fit in probably be New England, bro. Yep, New England. And you don't want to go there. And he don't want to go there. Don't nobody New England's go to New a great England, fit for us. <laughs> That's Man, a great go to Pittsburgh, bro. Pittsburgh, yeah. You said something then, now. I ain't got anything about that. And the weapons around him. But no, nah, shout out to Mike Tomlin, though. I do salute that. Yep. What you got, Marcel? For what? Closing remark. Oh, um, oh, man, I need to get this money, man. I need picks. Send picks, man. Oh, man, we get the prize picks. Yeah, yeah let's do it. Oh, hell yeah. This is my first one. Oh, man. Hey, um, first of all, I love the show, but I was just calling to see if his dad was single. Um, I think he's really cute. And I'm my shot, so. Hey man, block that motherfucker. <laughs> so something or I don't know, but yeah. <laughs> Keep doing what y'all doing. I love the show and yeah, shout out Broken Flaggy. Shout out to that. All right, so we we good on the voicemails. Well, that's good. <laughs> we appreciate it. <laughs> Cause he he probably just had a call real quick. Bad like he'll play this one. Oh. <laughs> call real. real quick. Hey, I got CJ Stroud over 270 yards. I like it. Oh, they got to win that game to get in the playoffs, too. Mm-hmm. Give me CJ Stroud, man. I like Pickens over 56.5 receiving yards this week. All right. What you got, Marcel? I like Geno over 237 passing yards this week. Who are they playing? They, and they lost. Arizona. What you think about them losing? Oh, I had that. I need, really? D- I need yeah. DK to score a touchdown, bro. I yeah, so you said Gino over 237? Yes, sir. What you got, Greg? What? <laughs> you got That's some? a three pick? Yeah. We ain't gonna win shit. All right, look. I do, a, do another one? Yeah, yeah, we'll do one more. God damn. Go. <laughs> Yeah, you, 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 you do a picky man. Shit. Um, you nigga want to win it. We ain't going to never get no damn 42. <laughs> <laughs> I'm taking Baker Mayfield for over Baker oh. Mayfield. That's a good over. one. They playing the Panthers? Hell yeah. At home, too. Must that win. That might be good Must win. You got I like another, how you said that with confidence. Like you got that. another one ready? Uh, and if you're in the Atlanta area, man, make sure you got them. 
bring your big ass to fit fitness. <laughs> no, it, them people New Year's resolution. Bring, come, come on, man. In. It's that come time look. of year. I'm not. It's easy right now. Come on I'm in. Because I'm going to have my fat ass in there, too. I'm going to start going. Uh, Gardner Miss you uh, under 232.5 passing yards this week. Mm. That, that's against your boy Stroud. Yeah, and then, you know, and you defense forgot defense. defense. Yeah. I don't know. Joe Flacco lit up that defense. <laughs> That's Flacco, bro. That's yeah, Flacco. Different, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to go Kenneth Walker over with the rushing yards. How many? 62 and a half. Against Arizona. Huh? Arizona. They got a shitty defense. Yeah. Um, more. I'm sorry, more. <laughs> more. More. Less on Garmin shoe. More on Kenneth Walker. We'll put 100. Bring back 25. Woo! First of the year. First of the year. This is our first one. We win this first one. Oh, shit. Bro, 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 bro. bro this is the, this the beginning. It's only up. It's only up. Got to think positive. Man, we appreciate y'all tuning in to Broken Play for the first episode of 2024, man. Hope y'all have some New Year's resolutions, some New Year goals. Tackle them. Complete them. Anything you believe you can achieve. Amen. Get some money, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> he said to the Pistons. Shout out to Reggie Ball. Shout out to Marcel. Shout out to Greg. Shout out to Yvette. And shout out to NoCamera.net and NoCamera Thad. And you know it's shout out to Dom. Y'all hate Dom, but shout out to him. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll be back on Broken Play. Hell yeah.